we're bringing back more experience, more starters than we did the first two seasons. And with you know implementing new new systems on both sides of the ball and working with these this senior class a lot. You know they have played a lot of sophomores and as juniors and getting things to to click finally. You know they're getting to the point where the coaching is less and less. You know and really being able to fine tune on the nuances of stuff they need to do to be able to be successful. And you know it's just not all new. So it's nice with this group. So it's a talented group with and they're experienced now and they've they put their time in. You know so we're looking for a lot out of them this year. We have high, very high expectations for this group. Bringing uh, Joe Strangarity back as inside linebacker and fullback is uh, first team uh, linebacker last year and really going to showcase Anderson Beamer as tailback. Um, Weston Martin, who started last two games uh, when Tyler Horse had a knee injury last year and showed a lot of potential quarterback, he's going to he's going to be strong. We have um, Derek Shaw, wide receiver. We have um, uh, Kyle Kelly, Tyler Eby. So we're, we're strong in the skill positions, real strong in the skill positions. And, and a couple last year, we you know we struggled with times up front. And this year we're bigger and more experienced. Guys like John Schonauer and Zach Boley and uh, Ian Portero, George Heinerman, a few juniors are going to be able to step up and play. So we'll be bigger and stronger up front to complement our skills this season. You're never quite sure what other teams are bringing in, but you know I, I think I think. We, we should be as good as 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 anyone, you know, and that you know that doesn't necessarily mean that you know how it's going to pan out on a Friday night. But you know, we should be as as good as anyone we play.